daily drive-by. What's going on, y'all? Hope you are having a blessed week, a happy week, a healthy week. And even if it's stressful or it's been the worst week of your life, I hope that it gets fucking better um, because there's always a chance, there's always an opportunity for improvement and uh, to change that mindset. And so I've been thinking uh, lately after I heard a podcast talking about role models and uh, how there's people out there that make the, let's just say, excuse that they don't have somebody to look up to. They never had a role model, this and that. Uh, But we have role models in our life in every way, shape, and form. And even if we don't have this person where it's like, gosh, like I idolize you, I want to be like you, I like the things that you do, the things you work on, the things you say, there's a lot of people out there that are role models in the other way where it shows us what we don't want in life, where it shows us what we don't want to be, like how we don't want to act, what we don't want to do, what we don't want to be like. And I think that teaches us more of a lesson than those people that we idolize and that we look up to um, because through pain, through adversity, through hard times, through hard conversations, as long as you approach it the right way, you take more away from it, you learn from it, and you develop and grow. But not only that, it teaches you a valuable lesson of you know, how you don't want to interact with people, uh, what you don't want to focus on in life, the things you don't want to talk about, the things that you don't uh, want to partake in, or the rabbit holes to go down. And so no matter what your situation is or how you grew up or the environment that you're in, just know that your destiny is solely controlled about you and the mindset that you have. And so use those people that might not have the best light or shine the best light in your life. Look at them as role models as well. And secretly in the back of your head, thank them for teaching you those lessons um, that brought you to the realization of what you don't want to be, who you don't want to become, and what you don't want to do in this life. You know, you can find those outside factors of celebrities that you look up to, that you idolize, that you use as role models to fill that void and continue to do that. But also know that the situations that are going on in your life are happening for a reason and they're teaching you something. And so how are you going to take that something and implement it and interact it uh, with your day-to-day life, with the way that, you know, you uh, pursue the things around you? And so... We often get caught up in those those hard times, those bad moments, those tough conversations, those fuck this person moments, and let them tear us down more than they should rather than build us up. And so again, as I talk about to you guys a lot or as I preach a lot both in the newsletter, on the podcast, and here even in these daily drive-bys is that life is all about the perspective that we put on it. The situations that we go through are all about the perspective that we put on it. And during those hard times and when we're going through that, it is extremely hard to see the positives because there's so many negatives that surround it. And so typically when the storm blows over is when we find the bigger light or the light at the end of the tunnel for that given situation. Um, But try and find that sooner so that way you can go on and live a happier, healthier life. Whether it's somebody you know that, you know, was addicted to alcohol, was addicted to drugs, um, uh, you know, fatality in your family, somebody passing away, um, an argument that you get in because you disagree on politics, like whatever that is, whatever that thing is, or even, you know, somebody that you can't uh, rely on, you can't trust that you wish you could, your parents, your siblings, your family, your friends, somebody cheated on you, whatever that situation is, Thank those people internally for showing you what you don't want to be, who you don't want to become, and what you don't want to do in life. Because that ultimately is going to drive you to live a better, happier, healthier lifestyle uh, because you know what you don't want. And so again, take those individuals in your life, um, the good, the bad, and everything in between, and use that to, to form and shape you and to hone in on what you want to focus on in this life while we're here uh, because it's so short and it can be easy to get caught up and and lose your faith in those moments and lose uh, the momentum and energy that you have because it's so draining and you feel like you're all alone and you have no one to go to or look up to uh, but you do and so 
Harness that energy, harness that, uh, that power, that charisma, that passion, that drive that you have to go and tackle the things that you wanna tackle um, and achieve the things that you wanna achieve. Like I told you, sometimes these daily drive-bys are gonna be longer than others, sometimes they're gonna be shorter, uh, and the, this one's gonna be short. Every single person in your life, every single person around you that you see, that you encounter, is a role model in some way, shape, or form. But it's just going to depend on how you're going to take that and run with it, or roll with it, um, and what you're gonna get out of it. So, the only person that uh, has your back fully, the only person that, uh, can change things is, is the person that's one listening to this or the, the person that's speaking it. And so from me to you, go and live your dreams and, and use all of this uh, stuff that the world gives us, whether we ask for it or not, as that motivation to just be better and do better every single day. That's what it's about. And for me, it's about impacting one person a day. Got that motto from First Form when we joined and partnered with them, uh, the supplement company, and their uh, whole thing is they just wanna impact one person a day. If they impact one person a day, then they know that they're making a, this world a better place and they're impacting it in the way that they want to that align with their views. And so since we align with them and partnered with them, um, I wouldn't have done that if their views didn't align with mine and Dylan's and DTI and what we're building. So go out there and use every single person in your life as a role model in some way, shape or form. Thank them for it internally, unless you wanna voice it um, and then Keep driving after your dreams. We get one shot at this life. Today's the first day of the rest of your life. Make it count. Love y'all. It's all.